David Bustamante, and I am uh, the director of the Island Way, which is a sort of a Polynesian, Tahitian type show group that's been around since 1993. I direct the group, give it musical guidance, along with my daughter, who choreographs all the dances and, and um, teaches all the basic Tahitian moves for all of our students. My name is Evelyn Bustamante, and I am the co-director of my family's dance studio, the Island Way, from Concord, California. I was five years old, and we had a family trip to Disneyland, and back then they had the Tahitian Terrace, and they had a Polynesian floor show during our family dinner, and that is what captivated me. It's music and dancing, uh, drumming and dancing, the culture and dancing. Every aspect of it is important. It's the life that the people live, and, and they put that in their music and dance. So it's, it's kind of a rich culture, it's very deep. And so with all those ingredients, that, that's what intrigued me about it. The music, the music and the drums. It's so loud and you feel that beat. It just makes you want to move. It's grown tremendously. There used to be maybe one or two halals that, that uh, can do Tahitian dance and music decently. Now there's, oh, I would say, at least double, two dozen that, that are doing it. Um, and so it's grown very much uh, with the advent of uh, the computers and the internet. Now that uh, you know, information can get you know, be obtained much easier now. Back when I was just learning it, you know, trying to learn and, and research and all this was very difficult. There, were, there was no resource material. You had to rely on your friends or actually have to go to Tahiti yourself and to try to grab as much as you can and understand it. So it's a lot easier nowadays. My name is Anita Jimenez and I teach at Diamond Way Studio. I've been dancing with the same studio for about 14 years now and I teach, I've been teaching for the past seven years. My favorite part about teaching them is when I give them a new move, they improve very quickly. You can just see the excitement in their faces. When they see that they improve, they want to keep pushing themselves. How long have you guys been dancing? Four years. Four, Four years? years? Four years, wow. Do you guys like dancing? Yeah. What's so, what's, what's so good about dancing to you guys? <laughs> It's fun. It's fun. Why? Because <laughs> it's just fun. Yeah. Yeah. Do you guys do you guys like coming to practice? Yeah. Yeah. How about what's your favorite part? kids improve, um, seeing my fellow dancers improve as well, and just always dancing with each other. We treat each other like family and it's not just we come here and dance and then we leave, it's, it's more to it. Um, we hang out with each other, we consider each other family, we're all dance sisters, we've known each other for years, and I think that's what makes our bond very unique and very strong. Most important thing in the culture is um, respect and uh, family. The most important thing is that um, Tahiti is Tahiti. It, it belongs to Tahiti. And um, I, when we when we left there, the, the last thing I said was, "Don't change your ways," because it's very special. And um, they are very proud and they're very humble. And what they, you know, so um, that was the. Probably the most important thing that I learned. Um, uh, they don't have much money, but they're rich in culture, and that's the only thing they have left to hang on to. It's really a very family-oriented activity. But as far as 
dance, I mean, it's appreciated around the world, and, and it's going to grow some more.